talking about my generation. Now I want to talk about today's youth. Today's youth. Do I need some oil? <laughs> <laughs> it's nice to see my son, our choir director, is almost on time for church. <laughs> but almost don't cut it in the kingdom of God, do it? <laughs> Today's youth. They say they're not in church because it's too early on Sunday and they too tired. Well, guess what? I'm tired, too. Tired of being blasted by harsh language out of car stereos. Tired of seeing our girls with their shorts and their skirts too high. Tired of looking at our boys wearing their pants too low. But most of all, I'm tired of rap. And them rap clubs keeping our kids out so late on Saturday night that they can't get up early on Sunday morning and go to church because they too tired. Y'all yeah. know what place I'm talking about, too. That place downtown. And don't you all let them fool you into believing that it's a good thing. <laughs> and keep our kids safe and, and, and off the street. <laughs> what I am sure about is that I wouldn't let my son or daughter support something as blasphemous as that club, and neither should you. People, we got to come together as a community and eliminate the harmful influences of hip hop and end the powerful grip it's got on our children. Yeah. Young women, got to stop being video vixens and start being valedictorian. Young men got to stop being gangsters and start being graduates. Right. Young people got to turn off that stereo and turn on G. O. D. Uh-huh. G. O. D. Uh-huh. G. O. D. Uh-huh.